y'all. It's Lindsay with the Fiber Seed, and it is Whip Wednesday where I share what I've been working on, which are some things. First up, did you think that I finished my swatch of Aurora Borealis, which is the January color of the month, releasing this Friday at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time? <gasps> that's not the thing I need to show you, but that's what it looks like. Look at this. This is what I'm talking about. Isn't that gorgeous? So it's got really deep teals, greens, and pops of Tiffany. Oh my goodness, it's gorgeous. And the speckles of blue on it. Did I finish the swatch? I did. Did I block it? No. Didn't. I will though. I love how it turns out. I could totally see a sweater. Here we go with my sweater talk again. I could definitely see something like that though. Or pairing it with the colors to go with it. Be a boss sweater and a shawl or a wrap or socks, whatever you fancy making. So anyway, that's what that looks like. What else have I been working on? I almost finished this. Shrink in the wash. No, just kidding. Do not shrink in the wash. I am knitting a baby sweater, not for myself. Um, knitting the Rexy mini. So it's done by Maison Denae. And I'm making the um, 12 month old size and the six years later. Um, but I am not necessarily on Sleeve Island. It's gone pretty fast. I made myself, a, although I couldn't find my row tracker um, post-it from Billy and Baugh because I was in the wrong room. I made myself one real fast. I have a sleeve. And now I'm almost halfway done with the sleeve. So I'm super excited about how this is turning out and I cannot wait for the little recipient to get this so I can get some pictures because she's adorable and she makes knitwear look super adorable. So I cannot wait to share this once it gets to Amelia. So that is how that's turning out. It's making me really excited about making Penelope one because I was kind of concerned about how long it would take me but this one came out real quick, so I'm not too concerned about penalties, even though it's going to be for a, a five or six year old. I think I'll make it a six. I don't know. I'll measure her. That's the magic. Measure the person. If you have them in the available range to measure them, um, because I don't want to give her something that's like this super oversized sweater, although that'd be super cute on Penelope. Anyway, so those are the things I've been working on. I have my temperature blanket out of shot on the floor with the month of March laid out where it needs to be attached. And I ran out of stitch mark locking stitch markers to put it together. So I'm playing a very dangerous game of is it going to get trampled on in 30, no, there's 60 of them. 60 little hexagons go scattering across the floor and I had them stacked up for like, what, eight months? Um, in perfect alignment. We'll find out. I'll let you know if that happens between now and next week. Um, until next time though, happy crafting.